Hello out there subscribers and friends, this is Surviving 2 coming at you with another video. Well hello out there in YouTube land. Okay, this is probably going to be my last stove video because I've pretty much gone through everything. This particular stove here, my tin can stove, I hadn't done wood in it since I made the new one and showed y'all what was going on there's a door that goes on it and then I've also got a screen right there that goes on the top now this is a new model and it seems to work pretty good so far this is going to be the last test I'm going to go ahead and load up everything in here get it ready with wood and then I'll get right back to you okay I've got some cedar bark I scraped off and put down here in the bottom and I've got a lot of little twigs in there and we'll take and go ahead and get this thing started up put that on there before it starts getting too hot and see what we can do. Okay, it's going pretty good. I gotta keep feeding it. Uh, got something to show you here though, real quick. Uh, see if I can get it in frame without getting it melted. It's a little plastic container with a handle on it. That's where I keep all my wood in. It was an ice cream container. And it works pretty good for just sticking my, you know, wood in there and just keeping it dry and everything. Go ahead and throw a couple more pieces in there and make sure that thing is going to stay going. Okay, it is now five, yeah, 5.59 right now on the dot. 
I'll keep stoking this thing up. And as you can see, I can close the door if I wanted to. And opening it shouldn't be that much harder. Come on, there we go. Okay, I've got a rolling boil on it, and it is now 6.09.10, so not too bad. I'll put times up uh, at the end of it. One thing about this little puppy, it uses up wood fast. It will burn through wood quick. As you saw, I was having to put a lot of wood in there. And there's still a pretty good amount in there. But when it gets done cooking, I mean when it gets done with it and everything, it burns it down to ash. I mean it takes it all the way down. There is nothing left of the wood when, it, when it's done burning. It's got really good airflow going through it. So, I can cook three ways with it. I can cook alcohol, I can cook wood, and I can also cook uh, with that little burner, these little canned, canned heat things I make. So I can cook three ways with it. So, that works out pretty good. The door, and uh, you probably caught it on the video, I was having to take it and open it up with a stick because naturally metal in there and that heat that got hot pretty quick but once it was swung open here it cooled back down and I was able to take it and close it and I didn't have a problem holding on to the little door screw so anyway that's enough of that y'all take care See you on the next one. Later. I want to thank you for watching this video and I hope you enjoyed it. If you want to see more in the future that I put out, just subscribe. Until then, later.